Right. How far are you good with that thing? Okay, from this fence right here? Okay. But, but from like if you just came right around to my right, like just right by that Coke, the Fanta can, could you hit him at the van? Okay. I take it you brought more than one. So two two five apartment six. So that's this side. side. Yeah. So we can't see him. I'm gonna go to the other side of the van. See if I can see him from there. Unit that has his brother. Why don't you do the unit that has his brother? Can you do the beaker three two one? Are you out with the brother? Brothers on the phone with the gentleman here at uh, 213. Uh, when you hear him talking to the brother on the phone here. One out two. Can you start me one unit, one more unit? And then uh, have that unit go to Chico in Dallas. And then have everybody call out with their 20s right now, please. Can call PD10 units that can clear out Chico in Dallas. PD units on the 27th floor, stand by for time check. PD Baker 336. PD Baker 336. Uh, 
for all 213 Dallas Northeast. Pete Baker 325. We're in the parking lot directly east of the target 20. Temple Baker 331. She's going Dallas. She's going Dallas. With Baker 325, just east of the target 20. Can you start 4355 for a 45-year-old male, conscious breathing, highly 1018, cannot stand up on his own, and we're going to be behind the church's chicken. Temple. Now 32, does the unit at One of two, can you, who do I have on the west side of the apartment complex off of, uh, On the west side at two nineteen dollars. Well, they taught us that in the class, right? They did. This looks weird, but I mean it's stable. Um, obviously, you don't have like you, same, three, three, you don't have the mobility, you know, if I needed to, but. I don't. Another new, good news about this, although we don't have that perfect view anymore. We, uh, we're not going to be the first thing he sees either, I would have to guess. Because he's going to walk out, he's going to face that way, he's going to see that way. Can you go back inside? Can you 
go back inside? Can you check with us the area commands 82? It's 1076. You're doing 76, Tom? You stay inside, ma'am. You stay inside. Stay inside. Okay. So even if you're already on scene, they require that you go do that stuff? You have it all in your unit somewhere? No, I have to go get my truck from the sub. So I'm switch. I have a bomb truck that has all my gear in it. Oh, you're trying to go bombs? I have bombs. Oh, you are bombs? Yeah. I've been on bombs for years. So I'm full time field, part time bomb. It's like the best speed ever. Really? See, I didn't know that. I thought you had to be full time. Nope. Over there. full timers, and now just one of four part timers. We're allowed eight certified guys. So, um, out of the trying to get a new unit by all other errors. That's 4355. should be there. Ten four. when you go tonight, I'll put you on the call. Thank you, sir. So if it's not in your area command, how do you find out when they need you or where they need you? Go ahead. Go ahead. Ten four. Baker, three three one. If you can continue to the forty three one, I'm going to eat you. That'll stop just a moment for you. Ten four. Baker, three three one. If you can you have a brother on the department, right? It's an uncommon name that you both have. Is that a hard gig to get into? How long have you been on? Department. Department. In this town, I don't know if it takes seven years to lose the, the rookie. It's more helpful. Go ahead. Just an update. No longer can get the subject on the 21. Last time I spoke with him, he was still 39. Refusing to come out. And I guess our charge is he actually pointed a gun at somebody?
Actually, no longer five six, and we only have a witness five six to the possible hexagon. Ten four, the victim no longer five six, and only a witness currently five six to the hexagon. Yep. Is that on the Dallas call? Ten four, that's on the Dallas call. Have information the person wants to look them up and get a 21. Like, hey, dude, we need to come back. PD Charlie, 412 without 49, only on subject beach. Available. 
Yeah, I'm with you because I mean, you go to the door. Did they say it was 40 through 1? Um, I didn't hear anything about 40 through 1. I just heard he's 39 refusing to come out. We have a witness that said that he was pointing an AR at people in the area, but apparently the only person that might be considered a victim had left. The only concern I have is what reasonable information we have that we're ever going to get victims back here. Someone said 43 one for something, but I don't know if it's our guy or not. What is a separate 43 one call that came out of 733 to 337. Go ahead, sir. Hey, once he gets checked out, are you good? We can cut him? Or you need me to hold on to him? I think we're good to go, sir. I have this 49. Tower. Any updates on this call? Negative, sir. Other than what RCD is currently advised, the caller and the wife did state that they had power of attorney over the 1030 that they picked up. I don't have any update on the ping as of yet, and the caller and wife are no longer facing me. 10 4. everywhere. You have to be at the front of the uh, yep. Crown Vic, but yes. you can't do it. I don't, I mean, either way, you know, if he comes out again, I don't know if he knows we're here yet. I'm not yeah. sure we should challenge him, you know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, Let him come out until the open, like he said. Let him come out to the open to where you can be in play. Because otherwise, if we challenge him before that, it's just me and that's it. Yes, sir. 
just wanted to give you a really quick update at least from our position. Um, that can kind of come out through what hopefully it is him, but even from our position, we don't really have a visual of the front doorways usually. We're in kind of the only spot that I can you know, deploy 40 to the screen. The problem though is if he comes back out, there's um, that whole fence along the east side um, with that uh, cinder block. Peter's Charles 337. Um, it kind of comes out to the, the actual driveway where the front of that, that convict is. That would be my clearest shot, but if he's just standing directly outside, I won't have a, a clear shot before you to see your work. Then ask me if he comes out like that again if they want us to challenge him. He's coming back outside. Yeah. If you can safely challenge him from behind cover, then do so. 10 4. He opened the door. It's going to be the one with the flag. Uh, he stuck his arm out at first, but he hasn't stepped all the way out yet. Yeah. I'm going to get a look at him. Still on the 21. No, he's he's on the 21 with somebody right now talking. Albuquerque to him. police, come to us. Put your hands Albuquerque in the air. Police. Walk to us. Walk toward us. Come here. Do what we We're say, and we can guarantee your safety. But you have to come to us. Joe, put your hands up and walk out to us. Joe, come out to us with your hands up and we can guarantee your safety. Come, come out and talk to us, man. We're here to help you. Be advised. Bring me thirty-six and. Officers at location are making contact with the subject. Talking with them right now. 10 fire. Patriot 325 subject, just come back inside. 10 fire. He was yelling something about come fight him, and then he slammed the door on us. You know what, dude? Obviously, we need permission to do this, but because of what you just said, that's probably better cover than this, anyways, at a better angle, the corner of that cinder block. And then I'm sure you're tall enough, you can look, you could shoot the 40 over top of that yeah. if you were to close on us, but that's just a better spot. Because from here, I have to yell at him. Right, well, we're going to have to yell at him until we can get something to do PAs. Yeah. This isn't really the spot we want to try and communicate with him. That's what I'm probably saying. The better spot, if we're better spot than there. Well, for our role right now of covering, okay. Um, we want to have lethal cover at our angle. I don't think our priority right now is communication, though. Okay. All right. Okay. They they need to kind of get a plan together on how we're going to do comms with the guy because we can't be we can't be doing the comms with the here. I can probably advise them. See if they want to get a group of other people over there.
Like, oh, yeah. He'd crumple and go inside. Hey, the other thing we got, dude, is we got this area right here, this back. There's an alley behind the 20. Right. I just want to make sure Casey pops out that way. We know he can go that way. No, that's fine. Because yeah. we can't sneak up on us. Yeah. can't flank us. I'll, I'll try and cover there. Say 10 8. Yeah. 40 through 1. That's it. Nothing. Ten three. Zero, 10 3. Break 335. Sir, 43 through 55 for a 20 year old male. Conscious breathing. Highly 10 8. Comes pretty quick. Can you stay inside, man? It's a police emergency. Can you stay inside? Is this his first name or last name? Joe. Uh, it's a pretty common last name for yeah. IMAs. Yeah. Yeah. Three three six or three three four. We have a looks like a mother and a kid kind of walking direction. If you could tell them to go back inside. Yeah, it's all yours, man. It'll take me a second to finish one, anyways. Two to midnight. You can still mostly keep a day shift uh, schedule. I can still go to bed as soon as I get home, yeah. Yeah. or by one, and then I can be up by it's like a, eight or nine. A swing that actually gets under semi reasonable time, but you still get them at ten. I remember working yeah. three to eleven. And that kind of stuff. Yeah, that's what we did. That's what I had last bit. We were three to eleven. That was rough. Every day it feels like, you're working, yeah, and you're working the heart of swing, so you're just that eleven o'clock getting off. I felt already drained, it's, so you know you don't really actually get to sleep until past midnight. Get off the so. This one at least I have ten. Uh, I have tens. So I have three days off.
Oh, I have Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday off. <sighs> right in the middle, huh? Yeah, that's kind of a stinker as far as... Yeah, we still have... Oh, see, I need Thursdays off the train. But I, I don't mind having my weekdays or my weekends off in the middle of the week. It's, you know, you, uh, you go to a movie or up to dinner or something. Everything's open. Everything's, like, empty. You don't have any lines. advantage to having a weekend off. Well, I have a wife and a kid, so. I do too. And they, well, that's the day she has off. Oh. Yeah, so yeah, well, I get no days off with, with her. See, I don't either, but it works out good for my kid, because then I watch him on the days that yeah. she Can't. works, and then she watches him the days I work. So, yeah. We just kind of mix, and then we have him take care for the... I guess we could do that. Well, I'm going to roll my vehicle, uh, kind of along where to work guys are at. You guys can just, uh, if you can move to my vehicle and uh, we'll use that as a point of cover. 10-4. Oh, the yeah. Once, once he gets up here, we're going to move to him. Get your tactical water bottle. What do you think would be the best spot for his unit? Up by this wall or to go to that Crown Vic? Nothing's good. Like if you yeah, nothing's right, great. Nothing's good. Uh, I, especially since somebody has to be driving the unit. Someone has to be sitting in the bullet box? Yep. Yeah. There's, I mean, that, that's what the Bearcats for is to drive up in our vehicles. So that we can make yeah. I mean, the car is better than nothing, but. I would say the best thing to do. Come this way. This Go to the cinder block. So that the driver can at least bail out the driver's side and still get behind the other block. And then as they come in this direction. Yeah, he'll know. He knows we're here. <coughs> no. He has a perfect angle to just crack you. Yeah, he's going to see see the approach way, way before. Yeah, I'm just hoping to drive right into the parking lot, dude. <laughs> Although, I'll tell you what, if he puts the two front tires on this lip right here. Did I leave it down? No, not yet, okay? I'm okay. sorry. Hopefully it'll be over soon, but if you could just wait inside for a little while longer. I can't tell you for sure, but it, we're hoping that it won't be too much longer. Can I just back around the way I came? No, no, because un unfortunately we have a uh, a dangerous suspect, and we don't want you to get in the way. Okay, oh. I'm sorry. So listen, if he puts his two front tires right there, 
now you got your engine block sitting like this instead of straight, so we can't shoot into the window as easy. So you, at least you're sitting back. Yeah, but it's better not. Bullet, bullet drops through the windshield like the uh, ballistics. It all tends to bullets go through and drop. And hit, yeah. Refract low. Yeah, like through low, out high. But not to say that that would be significant. I, you're in the, the driver's seat. It's always weird, like, oh, we'll use this as rolling cover, and I'm like, yeah, except we gotta drive him, man. He's a sponge. I, I hate that. I, I understand the concept of using it as rolling cover. Sure, it's better than tombstoning it and walking straight up the street, right? Yep. But I, I, I don't, I see very few advantages to that. Because what happens if the guy starts dumping bullets? Do you all now just barricade behind the vehicle, and now you're, you're literally just stuck there? That's your. Yeah, You're pretty much your shelter in place. Jesus Christ, so, baby, pick a volume. Right, no, right. I'd rather approach along a wall or something. Inside right now. Are optimal, but if you have a building that... I feel, thank you for doing it. You can hopefully get to a corner faster. No. Than yeah. A car. There's only... I think maybe three points in the car that... Yeah, it's not it's not very strong. Uh, yeah, so the best spot obviously is the front because you got both the engine block and you got two wheel hubs, so you can you can pretty safely be back there. I guess your only other choice is the wheel hubs back there, but then the, like I said, the rest is just cardboard. So I. Doors open again. You got a gun. Hold it, cover it, cover it. Let's go this way so we got more cover. He's coming out with the gun. Hold cover. Here's the three. You need a little reaction force on the south side of the 20, at like 219. Whoever's walking up, stop there. He's coming right to you. I, can't see him. I don't know where he's at. Give command. One person, give command. Dallas, and she's on unit. Make sure you have good cover. We have a large amount of fire. He's going back inside. He's still got the, looks like a rifle. Unknown what kind. I can't see him, dude. He came back. 10 9. We'll cover him in as much as we can outside. Did he point the gun at you? Negative. He was just roaming back and forth, totally ignored us, and he's still in the 21 with somebody. Sound 33, Pity. Sound 33. I need to verify information. Neighbor Lucero. Yeah, so he started coming back this way. Cyprus. The and then he went, he stopped, went back, he went right around the other side of Crown Vic. So I came this way to get a visual and he went the other way on me. My problem is the same thing, dude. I can't shoot them through that. I mean, I can. I can. I can make shots, but they're gonna go everywhere. You can disregard on that. Twenty-one, twenty-nine. So maybe, just maybe high. So I can shoot over top of it. I mean, like hold, hold through as much as you can. Okay. I mean, and just you can have the same barricades you from the the direction, but at least if you already have your sights on that area. Uh huh. Have the advantage? Yeah, I, I hope so. 
Do you want to give commands if he comes back up? Yep. Hey, watch out. He's got like a direct line right for you. It's it's a long gun. Do you have a good shot through there? Get another citizen. So you're going to go verbal if he comes back out? Okay, and I'll just hold. And I'm not going to... Nope, nope, no, nope. yeah, I agree. Okay. I don't see any out on call. Yeah, I got you. Is it a dog? Okay, we, we'll do radio. Yep, that's him. Three three six to Sam three two. If you're gonna do that, just reference the uh, his firing line. It might be best to go to Domingo in Dallas, and then come south towards that cinder block wall in the southeast corner of that complex. Yeah, I don't want the building to break up the town. I'm not gonna come up too far up the up the uh, road. And at this point, uh, he's highly intoxicated, verified over the phone, and we have seen him with a firearm at this point. We do have uh, arrestable misdemeanor uh, negligent use as well. If I scoot, I'm going to scoot about this level, okay? I won't stand straight up. Could you get him from the front of the Crown Vic, do you think? If he stand... You no, know, with uh, 40. 
Okay. And you can make that shot with Hanga? It goes straight to voicemail, and it'll ring a few times. Okay. And he's going to give uh, verbal commands? Stay inside, okay? Uh, Ma'am, I understand, but your safety is more important than the inconvenience, okay? Okay, okay, back inside. Quick, quick, quick. He's screaming, he wants us to kill him. Can you hear the kid? 10 4, loud and clear. He's saying he's going to come out of the apartment, he wants us to uh, shoot him. Just for 49, the female is stating that that long gun or that rifle that he's coming out with doesn't work. It's an old one, but let's assume that, you know, it's a, it's a weapon. 10 4 looked awful real to me, but it, it did kind of look like a uh, uh, kind of an old style hunting rifle. Yeah, that's 10 4. Go Gotta treat it as it's real, you know what I mean? Looks real to me. No, I don't either. Mr. Lambert, we need you to 
your shelf from inside the apartment. Sorry, Sam 32. Can you try 21 225 Dallas 225 uh, apartment 8? And if I send a uh, shelter in place to get away from the windows? 325 Dallas Northeast Sorry, apartment number 8. on the 21, he seemed like he's getting hyped up. He told me profanities and hung up the phone. Okay, Sam 32. You see him? started. Can you shoot that far? Yeah. Oh. E even through the uh, rebar? Right. And you can see all the way to the door if he comes out? I just make sure he doesn't have any blind. You don't have any blind spots at all. If he comes out, you can see him, right? Okay. All right, because I got this rebar. I, I can't get a, any real good view till he gets to the front part of that Crown Victoria. Okay. All right. Just so you know. Okay. If 
I if I move forty over there, I probably won't have a good shot through this. Yeah, you wouldn't get it. You would have weak points. I get came, I could be kind of around that if you Yeah, it, it's not gonna go through there. And yeah. I'm not gonna have a, a really good shot with forty even from here with the uh the cinder block and the fencing over there as well. I'd have to kind of blob over it. Yeah. That's the other thing to worry about. There's just a thin fencing behind there, so anything that goes through is going to go all the way through. Yes, on that, I've got MCT4 available if you'd like them to start up. 10 4. 10 4, MCT4, let's put you on the call. Frank 336 to the unit mid block Charleston between Domingo and Chico. I haven't seen anything come through. Yeah, he's wailing. So. Temp 33 to the units on the west side of the building. Can you hear the PA? Temp 4, he's back outside the rifle. He's got the rifle. Yo, drop the rifle! Put it down! Put it down! Put it down! Drop it! Go, drop it! Drop the rifle! Drop the rifle! Put the rifle down! Drop the rifle. Don't reach for it! What's in his hand? Hands up! The leader around you. His brother's running up on you.
Okay, you go ahead and move in. You've got a long rifle. What you said, uh -huh. let me know. Move around behind me. Move around behind me. Yeah, go over where he's at. Go over where he's at. Go over to where he's at. Did one get? There's one in the leg, a tourniquet. Responding unit, Dallas and Chief of Crowd Control. Got a leg hit? What do we want to do? Go ground it. I want you to go ground yours. Yes, yes, yes. Shot. Can't put him in there, I shot. Go for a Can you catch a, uh, get my vehicle? Yes, I don't. Need more? Tourniquet, tourniquet. Yeah, you have another seal, is that it? Yeah.
going to be a walk down south from Domingo and Dallas. Okay, yeah. Sam, 36, city. Yeah. Any other units that are in route? Yeah, well, I still came right down. Okay, I'm good. Okay. I don't know. I heard an extra bullet go off. I don't think. I don't know if his went off or not. Okay. Just gonna do a body check with you. All right. I'm still alive. Okay. Okay. Do you want me to go off? No, that's fine. You look good. Charlie, you anything? No. No, I'll just check out. Okay, do you have something hit on your, your head there? I don't know. 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 Pam 36 to the units at Dallas and she goes through putting up tape. Yeah. Pam 32 to the unit at Domingo and Dallas. Get ready to move your vehicle. Reference the uh, fire still need to get through there. Mike 32, can you start up Chico and Dallas? 10 4 now. When that unit goes 5 6 PD, I need them to put up tape. And assist with crowd control. I'm going to drive the perimeter now. Make sure all units that are arriving have their taser videos running. All respond units, make sure you have your taser running. Hey, where's uh, Smalls? Uh, he's up. Th he's up there. He's let's, yeah. Uh, let's get you. Do you have anybody that, uh, like a buddy officer? That you can I call don't. One of your buddies, just any a friend, just a. Not a buddy officer. I don't. I can go off, right? Yeah. I'm gonna get yeah, my car. I'm actually driving the perimeter now, trying to lock down the inner and 